Hi, this is Angela. Welcome to my channel. If you are not subscribed to my channel, please consider subscribing. Today I will do a, a pickup card reading. You have two options. Choose one deck you like more or you are attracted to more. If you would like to have a personal reading, please uh, just uh, read more about it in the description box. And now let's do the reading. Hi, group number one. Let's see what they are thinking about you at the moment. They are thinking about new beginning. They want you in their life. They are ready to open their arms and start, for example, a new relationship or a new chapter. There are lots of emotions involved when they are thinking about you. They see you as a very positive, energetic and young person. Or if you are not young, uh, you are young in your soul. And that is something very important to them when they think about you. When it comes to their feelings, they have very positive feelings towards you. Actually, this is the card um, about your wish is going to be fulfilled. Actually, in this case, uh, if you are with them, they wish would be fulfilled. They have a very positive emotions towards you. They feel love, they feel passion. Yeah, when I say passion, he, here we have a king of wands and king of wands is someone who is very passionate, but he's also, uh, he's also mature and we have a line behind him. He's not someone or she uh, who is afraid of you or who is afraid to make a, um, a move towards you. If you are in a relationship, uh, there is a lot of passion between you guys. When it comes to their action, huh, um, we have here someone who is afraid to make an action. But in this case, I think that you maybe uh, are thinking that they will not make any action towards you and that you are sad. But when you see the card behind, Five of Pentacles, they have courage to approach you. What are they fears? They have a fear that maybe you are so stubborn and that you will not accept them or that a uh, relationship with you is not going to be the easy one. They are looking deep down in their heart to see what would be the best approach when it comes to your relationship with them because um, it looks like uh, you are not an easy person to deal with, sorry if I offend someone, but you may be someone who wants to be with them but you are not sure if they are the right person for you or they are not. Um, in this ring, there is a lot of mix, mixed emotions. And in this reading, your person is more interested in you, in your love, in your relationship, maybe than you are, even though it may look looks like it's not like that for example, in your mind, but in reality, they are more interested in you. What is advice for them? Three or four pounds? Um, actually, they are waiting for, for you to give them a, a sign that you want them, that you uh, want to be with them. If you're already in a relationship with this person, maybe they need more of your attention. Advice for you? Advice for you to stay and do whatever you want to do. Stay who you are 
because you are a queen of wands, someone who is very passionate, who is very confident. If you are not currently confident, that is advice for you. Be who you are, express yourself, um, stay positive. Because if you are waiting for them, they will reach out to you. And let's see what is the potential outcome. We have King of Cups. In this reading, your person definitely loves you. Um, they are imagining being with you. They are imagining life with you. And as I said before, their love in this reading is more intense uh, or their thoughts, feelings, intentions are more intense than yours. We have new beginning. We have a um, card that says that they have feelings for you. We have someone who is very passionate. Maybe you had, um, for example, in previous experience or previous uh, relationship, for example, that something bad happened to you. And that's the reason why you uh, keep your guard so high because you do not want to be hurt one more time. But when it comes to this person, this person is someone who is, um, at the same time, uh, this person is strong and passionate, but this person also can be very gentle, uh, very caring. You don't have to worry about this person. Hi, group number two. Let's see what your person is thinking about. We have the star. When they think of you, they think that you are very, very beautiful, charismatic. You are like someone who is maybe the most beautiful person they ever, they have ever met. Uh, your connection is something very special for them. Uh, the reason is because this is probably someone from your past, or maybe you know this person from your childhood, or if you are married or if you have a children, there is a children on this, this card, and that means there is some kind of connection to children. Um, and this is also card six of cups is card uh, of your soulmate. You have strong connection with this person. When it comes to their intentions, they have two pentacles. They have a lot of on their plates and they probably juggling two or too many things in their life. This person may have for example, two jobs. For some of you, they can even have two relationships. I hope it's not your case, but it's possible. And when it comes to today feelings, they have strong feelings for you. But when it comes to their actions and intentions, now we have two of sorts again. That means that they're not sure what to do uh, for you guys uh, if you're in relationship uh, with someone who has children that could be another thing um, I think actually is uh, something that may um, keep them thinking what to do when it comes to your relationship with them what is their fear? Uh, they fear that they will lose control. They are very masculine. They are very... Uh, they want to be uh, like an emperor. They want to have their uh, life organized. But with the children in, in this reading, and we have two women here, we have too many people involved in this reading. Um, your relationship can be very complicated with them. Five of Pentacles, uh, 
they want to be with you, but they are afraid that they uh, will lose something very important to them. It looks like that this is about someone who is in a relationship with someone else or um, uh, who maybe has family. And that is actually the reason why they are not ready to approach you or tell you what they really feel for you, but they have feelings. It's not about their feelings. Current energies, we have... The card about uh, creation. Uh, um, when when this card appears, it means that your situation is still uh, developing. Uh, advice for them is that they need to behave like a king of wands. They need to know exactly what they want and they need to be um, in control. Advice for you, we have... Seven of Swords. This is usually a card of cheating. And one more time, it could be cheating or it could be advice for you to change your strategy when it comes to this person because you need to change your perspective on them. And potential outcome is, even though if they, this person may have family and I never su suggest to stay in a relationship if you are a third party but the card the last card is suggesting that you actually if you work together um, you may you can make this relationship work out but it's too complicated it's very complicated for now if this person is not married or if this person doesn't have relationship with someone else the advice for you is to focus on your career and to focus on yourself and let this person have better uh, vision or wait for them to make a move or to change something but remember this is energy for now i hope you enjoyed the reading i know it's not too long but I haven't done um, long <laughs> videos for my channel for a while, and I hope uh, I will find more, more. I will find more time and give you more beautiful readings. I'm sending you lots of love and have a wonderful day.